hey guys welcome back so guys we are continuing our laravel 10 tutorial so now guys in this video we are going to see how to make the login and registration system in laravel okay so guys, basically we are not going to build this login and registration system from scratch but we'll be using a laravel starter kit package so let's go to our laravel documentation so we are on the docs of laravel and here is the starter kit guys so guys here is the uh, laravel breeze package for the authentication you have a normal bootstrap also but breeze comes with the tailwind css so we can use this so let's click on this laravel breeze and here is a view guys how it is going to look like and now guys let's move below and here is a command to install your breeze package via composer in our application so guys as we have seen in previous video we have already installed a laravel fresh application and now we are going to install laravel authentication system okay so guys let us paste here just right click and hit enter okay so let's hit enter and here it starts with the starts with the installation perfect so guys our laravel breeze package is installed and now let us install our breeze authentication okay so here you see after Composer has installed the Laravel Breeze package. You can go ahead with the command that is PHP Artisan Breeze install in your application. So, yep, let's copy this and get back again and just right click to paste. Not completely. Let's and hit enter. So, here it asks you some details. Just hit enter. Okay, so here it's asking for the value. So what do you want to include while installing this breeze? So I, I am selecting with the blade with appline. So you can just type this code blade here guys. Type blade and you see uh, would you like to dark mode support? Let's tell yes and hit enter. And which testing framework do you prefer PHP unit or pest? So let's give zero installing and building the node dependencies perfect so guys our breeze scaffolding installed successfully okay so now let me minimize it the terminal and now guys let us configure the database so first just go to your php my admin that is via zamp and now guys i am going to create one new database so i have already created the new database which is laravel tutorial here let's copy this laravel tutorial and you can get back to your editor just go to your env file and here is your db connections so here is my database laravel tutorial and username is root password is null and now guys let us get back to our documentation so here is the next step about migrate okay so which is going to push all the tables inside your database so let's paste here and hit enter so all the migration has been done so you can just get back to your database refresh so here you find all your tables guys okay now you can run the other commands so get back and here is one npm install and then npm run dev so first let us go with npm install copy paste hit enter so it installs the dependency packages done and now guys you can just start with the npm run dev copy and paste here and start with the run npm run dev so here you see our the local server for this node modules is started and now we have to start with our laravel server also so you can just give a php artisan serve okay so I have just opened a new terminal guys so you can see one terminal for running this npm and second is for our artisan so now guys you can see that it's running on localhost colon 8000 let's move refresh perfect okay so it's running and here you see guys we have a login and register button so let's click on this login perfect so we have selected with the dark mode so it is showing in a dark mode guys and if you get back just click on this register so here your dark mode of register comes 
and now guys let us uh, just register one user so user user at gmail.com password let me keep as password only again password and register perfect so you have logged in successfully and here is a user okay and you see that profile also and here you see guys the laravel breeze gives your profile information updating part here you can update your user like one and save the detail okay so it saved your username also and you have update password option and delete account also okay so let's click on dashboard and now guys let me log out and log in with the same user detail so we have registered and let's check with the login also so user at gmail.com and password is password only hit enter perfect so guys we have seen that how to create a authentication system in laravel using laravel breeze package so guys we have successfully done with the installation of breeze package and now guys let's continue in next video with new topic of this laravel tutorial so thank you for watching this video guys please subscribe like and share